Hey, I wanted to show you exactly how the Ultimate WordPress Mobile Redirect plugin works. Now, I'm inside of my dashboard area on my WordPress site, and once you upload, once you install the plugin, you're going to hover over Settings and come to Ultimate WordPress Mobile Redirect. Now, this is the Settings page, and once you purchase the plugin, you're going to receive a license code, and you plug it in right here, and that's how you activate the plugin. Now, down below where it says General Settings, once you activate it, this, everything will appear. With the plugin, you have the option to set a default redirect URL for all of your posts and all of your pages. And the great thing about it is that you can actually have a different default redirect URL for just your post, for just your pages. And of course, as I'll show you in a little bit, you can set up a different redirect URL for every single post and every single page on your site. So we're going, to head to, we're going to go ahead and check off post and page, click save changes, and as you can see there is now the option to plug in a default post URL and a page URL for both your mobile settings and for the tablet settings. We're not going to mess around with the tablet settings for now, I'm just going to show you how the mobile settings redirect works, but it works exactly the same for the tablet. So I'm going to go ahead and activate the default URLs, and I'm going to plug in the URL where I would like my mobile visitors redirected to if they come to my site from a mobile device. I'm going to hit Save Changes. Now I'm going to go over to the Pages section of my WordPress site. I'm going to go to All Pages, and I have a mobile test page that I'm going to show you. So I'm going to go ahead and edit the mobile test page. Now when you install the plugin, on every page and post, the ultimate WordPress mobile redirect widget will appear. So if you want this page, if you want the page that you're creating to redirect to the default URL that you saw that we just did, that we just put in place, all you have to do is click on the mobile activate. So once you check that and you go ahead and update the page, if somebody visits this page, they will be redirected to that default URL. So I'm going to actually go ahead and uncheck it so it's back to normal, and I want to show you exactly how it works. So if I view this page right now, this is how it would look if anybody visited it from a desktop site, a tablet, or a mobile device. But now, instead of seeing that page, if I go ahead and check activate the mobile redirect, and I hit update, if I now take this URL, I'm going to plug it into a simulator. Let's go for the iPhone 5. Remember, this is how it, will look, it would look if somebody visited the page on a mobile device. Now we get redirected automatically to the URL that I put in place. It says WordPress test page. This is a mobile test for the Ultimate WordPress Mobile Redirect. Again, you can see right here that it's the same exact URL but it recognizes that the person coming to the page is viewing it from a mo mobile device so they're being redirected to the default URL that I put in place. Now, you also have the option if you leave the mobile activate checked you can actually put in a different mobile URL that you want the visitor redirected to instead of the default. So let's just say we want them redirected to you know, a different page. I'm just going to put in Google. I'm going to go ahead and update. Now, let's go back to the simulator. If I refresh it, there you go. Now they're redirected to Google. We can test it on a couple different variations of the iPhone. Again, you see it works iPhone 3 and 4, the Samsung Galaxy. Now, this is going to work with every single major cell phone out there because we use a PHP detection, not the width of the screen, which is becoming a uh, outdated way of redirecting your mobile visitors. Now we're going to go back to the demo site. So that's exactly how it works. As you can see, you can set multiple redirects for every single page or every single post on your website, and you now actually have the ability to set a redirect for tablets as well and the tablets work exactly the same of course if the only difference is of course is if somebody comes to your website from a tablet and you have it activated and a different URL 
if they're going to redirect right to that tablet optimized page that you have created. Hopefully that gives you a good idea of how this plugin works. As you can see, it's very simple but very powerful at the same time. And if you have any questions, please don't hesitate to contact us. Thank you.